but this is this is where you gotta hit them up. The university they already know. I was asked to come down uh, and talk about performance and and being an MC or a rapper, right? And uh, I've been doing shows here in Montreal since '99. So I was uh, 17 when I started on stage. I started rhyming when I was like 13. My name is Yasin Al Salman, but people know me as Narsi. I mean, with my experience with kids in hip hop, I wanted to come in and just, you know, give them tips on how to perform and, and get on stage and, and forget about who you are for a second and give people your thoughts, you know? They get open and, and speak to you from their heart, which is through their rhymes, you know, because their rhymes are the most rawest form of who they are, you know? My name's Akeen. I'm 11. I'm just a kid, I'm just normal, everyday kid. I like writing. Like in class, when I'm doing like classwork, I don't like writing, but like when it's about music and stuff like that, I like, like doing that. Outstanding progress. So, so outstanding progress means that like, here's the class, is average, and then you're above that. Well, that's good. Still. Still what? You can't get any higher than a one. What do you want to be, the teacher? Yes. Oh, okay, well, then you better work on this one here. <laughs> Read. Well, you know, it's really interesting because uh, my son's in literacy through hip-hop. When he came home after the first day of the program, uh, he... You know, he wouldn't do it in front of me, but he took his big sister and, you know, I have a song and stuff like that. You want to listen to it? And he started writing it out. And I was looking at him and I was looking at my, uh, my big daughter and saying, there you go. The program to me is a success. Already he's sitting down and he's writing. Does anybody want some? Is there, where's the plates? Is there enough plates underneath people's plates? We have a huge family, right? Akeen has like, what, uh, 10 brothers and sisters. Oh and he like, wrote a story that's more relevant to him. Right about his family. Um, art, an art that talks too much. Oh yeah. You like that? No. All right. We'll try and find you something else. No. What's your rap? What's your? What are some of your lines? Because it goes like slow for slow? like ten seconds. And then my Writing it down is way easier because, like, it's just you. When I come home on the bus, because we're the last people off, so after my friends go off, I just think of songs. Because in the bus, all I hear is bumping and cars. So, like, sometimes I make, I make beats with that, what I hear. Great. So now that was really good. We're trying to one more. I just put down the melody. Melody. Do you guys, you guys know what the melody is? Do you, do you know what sampling means? Okay. Listen, 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 listen. <laughs> But they had more stuff, yeah? See, that was in the outside. So there's always three elements you can write to in the beat. There's the drums and the, the hi-hats and the kicks. The kicks are the <laughs> what makes your, your, uh, your stereos rattle. The hi-hats are the little tss, 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 tss. <laughs> My name is Aaliyah, a.k.a. Diva. My flow is fast like a beaten cheetah, and I don't lie, I'm a little shy. But this Diva is always fly. I'm the D to the I to the V to the A. I live in Little Burgundy, and that's where I stay. In Little Burgundy, I plan my stick together. In the fall, winter, spring, summer, no matter whatever. We watch each other's back anytime, any season. We watch each other's back no matter what reason. Yeah. <laughs> I think literacy is one of the main points in being an MC or being in hip-hop, is that you have to know how to express yourself. Literacy, hip-hop. 
My kids may not like literacy and the concept of writing and reading and stuff like that, but they like hip hop. So maybe I could tuck it in like, you know, hiding the vegetables underneath something there and they're going to eat it anyways. I think that's the parents' strategy. My big family, they're really crazy, but I got mad love for them because they made me. I love to make my brother mad because he goes crazy. Then he gets a little hurt and cries like a baby. Now I'm sitting on my bed looking at my funny sister. She's running around being a really big Trista. I also got a cousin who talks 24-7. When she's not around, it feels like heaven. My older sister, she's really funny. She thinks she's balling, but she ain't got no money. <laughs> My mom wants to make me smart, got me reading all the time. I'm thinking every day, that's how I want to copy drawing. What makes me feel good when I rap or when I sing is that I see that people are paying attention to me. Hey, my name is Little Missy. When I don't rap, I know that they miss me. It's funny how people get crazy. With Nikita, I found that uh, she has started to open up a lot more than from the beginning of the class. When I first saw her, she was definitely someone who had a lot of substance and she had a lot to offer to the program. So keep your head up, be proud. Don't make nobody say that you're a clown. For the record, I am very proud of all you guys. No, for real. Like, you guys came in here and you're not exactly sure what you're getting into. And you had all different places of interest in hip hop, interest in writing rhymes, interest in all this. But you guys really impressed me. Pat your hands, everybody, if you got what it takes. You need a chorus. My A-list name is uh, Little Missy, and I like singing. Uh, I sing at church. I sing a lot of songs, and I'm going to sing a song for you guys today. So I'm a little bit nervous, but I'm going to try and, yeah, I'm going to try and sing for you guys. Here we go. I just can't give up now. Come too far from where I started from. Nobody told me that the road would be easy, and I don't believe he brought me this far to leave me. Never said there wouldn't be trials, never said I wouldn't fall. Never said that everything would go the way I want to go. But when my back is against the wall and I feel like hope is on, I just lift my head up to the sky and say, help me to be strong. Oh, I, I just can't give up now. started from nobody told me that the road would be easy and I don't believe he brought me this far I don't believe he brought me this I said I don't believe he brought me this far to leave me thank you <laughs> <laughs> 